Hi, Peaks. Today's the big day. It's your big day? It's your big day. It's your big day? It's your big day. Hey, besties! Okay. It's my birthday. I'm old as hell. Valentine's birthday, and we are heading out. He won't literally tell me anything about anything, so you're gonna have to figure it out with me and have a good ass time together, all right? So, we were lucky. They let us slide and come into this place called And Waffles. I've never been here, but I saw that they had Eggs Benedict, so that's what I got. like a rapper. I do? Yeah. Say rap. Uh, we have to start with yo yo yo. Let's say it three times. Okay, yo yo yo. You gotta say it like mean it. Oh. Yo. Yo, no. Um. One, two. <laughs> no! Where'd you get peaks? This is what they call the creme de lejo de perreji, the perreji. What? Huh? That's not anything. That's how they say it. That's what it is. No, they didn't. It's on the menu. No, it's not. It's called the Jomorje Perrijoja. You literally didn't say the same thing. Oh, hey, I got you. I got you. I got you. This is called the Juafo de Flor with the Trinkle Pinkle and a little bit of strawberry Juaf. What? With a Juaf. Got me some eggs, Benedict. It looks very plain, but that's what I was craving. Eggs, Benedict. Who's Benedict? The homie. Who's, who's the homie, don't worry about it. You have no idea where this came from. No. Who made that? Benedict. Yeah, but who's Benedict? <laughs> So as everyone knows, because I'm a Pisces, I'm very emotional. And I get very, very emotional when it comes to my friends. And I'm more of the gift giver. I'm not used to gift receiving, but Dub, Brittany, and Wap got me something I wasn't expecting at all. And I'm still shaking. Like I'm still freaking out inside because this all just transpired right now. And thank you guys so much. I'm I don't even know what to say. I just know like in a few seconds I'm probably gonna start crying. I'm gonna do it off camera though. I don't wanna embarrass myself. You dragged me to a forest. Am I gonna go missing? <gasps> Are we gonna ride the swans? Oh my god, I know why I do this in some mood over here. Wow! We're in a swan boat! Look at all the duckies! Look at this little duck. I see you little duck. I wish I had some bread. Oh no, white ducks over there. So I got home and Peaks saw this. It's from Rosen. It's happy birthday, Valentine. Hope you have a great birthday. And always remember, you woke up today, so you already got the W. Celebrate your greatness, Moonbeam. Rosen. This. Wow, that looks so good. Thank you. <laughs> I feel undeserving. I, I'm a gift giver, and getting gifts is like an emotional thing for me. Ace got me this because I like pandas. And look at how cute this little spoon is. This is perfect. And he got me this little panda pen. These panda socks that I'm wearing. And then my chow got me this. I named this guy Grape because his tummy smells like grapes. This is a dragon squishmallow. Got this kitty cat Naruto rhyme bowl that I'm gonna use probably tomorrow. And then I finally, because everyone's been asking, oh my god, play Fortnite, play Fortnite. I can't always play Fortnite because I don't have a controller and I don't have it downloaded. But that's all gonna change because I have a controller now. And it's pink. It's pink, bro. Are you mad? Because you can't play Fortnite? And then, Dub and Brittany and Wop got me this. Let's open it together. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> and deserving is what I feel. <sighs> you should have seen earlier. When they actually gave it to me, I was shaking. I don't know how to react sometimes. Like, my anxiety went
Damn. Yeah. Oh. Hello? Brittany? Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Bro, it smells so good. I'm a weirdo. I like the smell of brand new shoes and <sighs> it smells so good. <laughs> Bro, these are hard. Damn, stop flexing. <laughs> these are hard. They're so cute. And like, it's crazy because I don't own Dior. I've always wanted to own like one thing from each brand. And I remember telling Brittany that like that's, a long time ago. That's what I told Brittany. She was, because originally they were going to get you Gucci slides. And I was like, nah, get her something from a different brand. I love this so much. Trust me, Brittany, I love it so much. But I thought it was, we're going to get like some like, BFF necklaces, like custom, like little necklaces or like, I think it's because I don't think about getting large things, but this is really like, I have no words, flabbergasted. I'm just like, I don't know. <laughs> so what you guys are gonna see next is I'm sending Valentine off on a solo mission, another gift. I think you're gonna enjoy this. You're gonna be going solo dolo. I'm scared. I'm gonna take my knife with me. You'll be take all right. <laughs> It's something only you can do. What is it? Give birth? I'm getting freaked out. <laughs> this is your second to last birthday gift. It says you're going to get there at 6.53, so you need to hurry. Okay. You have to be there at 7. Guidance is already set up, so just follow the GPS. Bye, peaks. I don't know what the heck I'm doing or where I'm going, but I feel like I'm going to die. So I am 0 0.2 miles away from this place. Chino gave me a hint saying something about... I said that I wanted to do something like this around Christmas time. It's March now, so I can't think of what I wanted to do on Christmas time. I'm really nervous. I'm at this place called Pause. I have no idea what I'm doing here either. So let's find out. No, I was told to come here at 7, but I don't know what I'm doing yet. What was the name under? I don't know if it's under mine or his, but um, Mark. Mark? Okay. Yeah. What is that? Oh, it's your birthday? <laughs> yeah. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> what is float? <laughs> so you're going to do an hour session just floating in what is essentially just 1,200 pounds of Epsom salt and water. Um, oh. So it's like a sensory deprivation pod. So you'll be able to see it. We'll give you the whole rundown while you're back there. But yeah, it's really relaxing. It feels good. It's wow. like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Right. I'm gonna just miss you so I can actually take you back. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna walk into the room with you and we'll shut the door and then I'll explain everything to you, okay? Okay. I can't hear anything now, and I get to just float in the water because I don't have a bathtub at home. So this is super awesome. Anyways, I'm cold, so I'm gonna jump in there. So I just left the place called Pause. It was literally amazing. I can't even explain it. It was so amazing. And it's crazy because, so Chino and I only have a stand-up shower. We don't have a bathtub or anything like that. And one thing that I actually really liked about the apartment, even though the bathtub wasn't huge, was that it had a bathtub and I could take a bath and just sit there and soak and relax and just 
that's where I relieve my stress or where I used to relieve my stress. And I'm not gonna go up in Ace's bathroom and use his bathtub. Like I just, I don't, I don't run like that, you know? That's his space, that's, I respect his space and all that. I'm definitely gonna be coming here more often. I got a few goodies from there. It's basically warm water that's heated from underneath because your body is like being soaked in salt. I got this, it's like a little pod thingy. I don't know what it's called, but it has like minerals and things that your body and your skin need. So it's a little piece of glass and you break the top off. You put your finger on the hole, you break the other side and you just let it shoot the liquid into your mouth. And um, yeah, it's supposed to be really good for you. I also got a turmeric shot and I got this really nice facial serum and my skin feels so freaking soft and so amazing. I'm gonna go back there, I'm gonna book the package and I'm gonna do this on a regular basis. So I'm so happy with the way that Chino did this for me. It was more than I could have ever hoped for. This whole day has been more than I could have ever even imagined. I honestly didn't think that I was gonna do anything today. I didn't think anything of today. I just thought it was gonna be a regular day. Like, and just everybody just made it so amazing. Even people that I didn't think would wish me happy birthday sent me a message or gave me a call. And I think one thing about me is like, the reason I think now I don't, why I don't like my birthday or the idea of it is because what if the people that you think that are around you don't genuinely genuinely remember or care and i think i've always been scared of people not remembering not having anyone message me or like tell me happy birthday or just like that i'm a thought in anyone's mind like that but today really proved otherwise and i really do feel special like within my friend group and as a person and especially with you guys like you a lot of you guys messaged me happy birthday wish me best wishes for my birthday and it was amazing so Thank you to everybody, especially to Chino, especially to Brittany, my mom, even Rosen, shout out Rosen for sure, Ace, a lot of people in our friend group, like, just thank you guys so, so much. Dub, Uwap, even to Shay messaged me happy birthday, thank you guys so much. I really, really, really appreciate it. You guys are amazing and I love every single one of you guys and appreciate all of you guys for making today amazing, really. <laughs> thank you.